Well, here at the Commodity Carnival, we're teaching kids how to grow and sell a steer. So a lot of them see the livestock and everything, but we're trying to show them what it takes to grow your own steer. So all of the factors that go into it. So your feed costs, all of the production costs, so health and nutrition, a facility, a barn for their steer to live in, and maybe some transportation, a trailer. How are you going to get your steer to the market? So all of those production costs are going into their steer and then um, towards the end of the game they're going to try to sell their steer so they want to make more than they just raise their steer for so we give them based on the weight of their steer we give them a production cost and then on the plinko board they're going to try to sell their steer and they can win prizes based on how much of a profit they're making we're really trying to get in the details of them so we'll start with do you know what a steer is and making sure they understand what exactly the game is trying to do and with each each cost we go through, we say, now this is going to be for your barn, your steer needs somewhere to live. So we're going through each detail very specifically with them, trying to show them that this is real life. This is what maybe grandpa or dad are doing at home, and this is what you're seeing. The Risk Branch app really came out of the success we had with the Commodity Carnival physical activity last year. We traveled to about 120 state and county fairs in 11 states, similar to this year, and reached about 50,000 4-H youth. So we had really great success with the physical game, but the app allows us to reach beyond fair season and allows kids to play once the state and county fairs are all done. So it's a free download for uh, your iPhone or your Android. You play it on tablet or on your smartphone. They have an opportunity to customize their steer. They can change its accessories and change its body color, even give it a new name so that they can continue to play and build their herd. Ultimately, what happens is this Plinko chip will reach the bottom, and then I'll go back into an area called the weight room, and I'll learn how many risks I hit, how much that impacted my score, how many of these coins I retrieved along the way toward the bottom. And then in the second season, we give the kids the opportunity to really invest in futures for the first time. So here in the physical commodity carnival, the kids don't really learn about futures. We're taking it a little bit further and showing that futures are a way that kids can protect the value of their steer for a short period of time. So it allows us to extend the education the kids are getting at the physical commodity carnival. It's a way to really extend the reach of the physical commodity carnival game. And uh, we want kids to be able to download it and play all year round. So they can find more information at cmegroup.com slash 4-H carnival, or they can download the game for free on their smartphone or tablet in the iTunes store or at Google Play.